how to use a multimeter. If you want to check continuity, if there's a break in the system, you switch it right here. That's going to allow you to check continuity, like for example, bad fuses in a vehicle or bad fuses in general. If you want to check direct voltage, uh, like from your car, you switch it here. That's going to allow you to check direct voltage. If you need to check ohms, resistance in a wire or in a, in a circuit, you go right here to this little horseshoe. You need to check microfarads, like to see if a uh, capacitor in the HVAC system is good. This checks up to 200. You go right there. If you need to check temperature, this becomes a thermometer. And you need a little wire, a yellow wire that goes here, and that becomes a thermometer. This, I'm gonna have to uh, skip this. And this is gonna be your amps. Although I think this, just judging by this, I think this is direct current, but at a much lower scale, but you could, you could correct me if I'm wrong your amps here like if you want to see if your compressor is pulling more amps than it should if your windings are going back to the compressor you go here you use this clamp and then here is direct I mean alternate current these are just a few of the basic uh, uh, things that you could check using this particular multimeter